All right, we are playing the Trapper. By subscriber request, we're here on Haddonfield, and we are. We're gonna try to be cheeky. The old ha Haddonfield. This was a really good trap location. All right, we're moving a little faster with our add-on. We got to go get some traps over here. We got to start picking up our traps, figure out where we're going to go with some of these uh, trap placements. Maybe catch somebody going around the house on the side here. I feel like this is a good spot. Can I trap that? Yeah. Why won't you? Why don't you let me place the trap, game? All right, my guess is they're on that gen in there. And they're going to commit to it. Oh, no, they're not. Okay. okay. Could that have been the Jill? It's the Meg. Hi, Meg. Meg, don't run that way. Meg, I really don't want to be chasing you here. Yeah, go that way, Meg. Run that way, Meg. That's where our traps are at. That's where we want to push her. Keep going that way, Meg. We want to herd her into... Go in the house, Meg. Up the stairs. Really? Well, that kind of sucks. <laughs> All right, Meg. That was cute, but... Oh, that's a little sad. I thought that trap at the top of the stairs was going to be good, but I guess it wasn't. The regens already gone. Oh my god. Are you kidding me? That's a nasty trap. Holy Holy crap, that nasty, nasty. Not like somebody was up here. Didn't it? Somebody's in the house.
Somebody's in the house. <laughs> All right. Oh, this is a nasty trap, Meg. Yes, Meg? I mean, I'll deserve it if you got it. They let her get to second stage. That Meg is now dead. Wow. Bye, Claudette. Have a nice time. All right, look, you guys have given me this three gen right here, so, you know. All right. Hug that loop, Claudette. Thank you, Claudette. Thank you, Claudette. We set that trap. Ah, that one worked out kind of perfectly. I'm going to hook you back here, Claudette. We can hear somebody in the building. All right, Jill. Joe, that gen has so much work on it. Yeah, I don't know if I can stop it. Well, she committed. She committed. <laughs> Honing stone means that person's going to be down on the ground. If we can just, unless they have unbreakable. Let's say I'm unbreakable. That will be a GG's there, Zarina. That hard. Nope. All right. Let's make sure she doesn't 4%. Kobe? Kobe into the trap. Nope. All right, where's Claudette? They did not use a hatch.
Which trap did Claudette trigger? I don't know where she is. Oh, I hear you. Hi. Hi, Claudette. You were in deep bushes, Claudette. I'm lucky I found you. I am lucky I found you, Claudette. All right. That will do it. Oh, they don't let you do the, uh... Yeah, I want to set traps. I want to get more points. All right. Solid match for us as Trapper, and that's pretty much a Trapper match. Lose gens early. Get yourself set up early. Get your area of control. Identify it. Protect it. And rely on hopefully some good trap placements to carry you and survivors to make just a couple of mistakes and the one thing the trapper can do he can snowball so the first problem was let's look at what we played against we had three console players we had one crossplay player my guess is the crossplay player which was the meg that died first uh was not with this group that they were a solo queue and Unfortunately, uh, gens before friends. These three were pumping out gens. Uh, nobody went to rescue the Meg. Uh, Meg died on two hooks. She didn't have decisive. Whoever unhooked her the first time didn't heal her. She had no way to heal. I mean, at least one of you brought a med kit. You know, at least one of you probably could have could have helped her. Whoever pulled her off the hook. We heard the Jill, and we suspected the Jill was in the house. We kept hearing footsteps. And in the end, when one of their group got hooked, I believe it was the Claudette, that's when we finally saw the Jill uh, make an appearance to get a rescue. Uh, we had some good trap placements. The one at the top of the stairs of the, of the, the Myers house, we're going to have to remember that trap doesn't work. Uh, there's just enough leeway. We're going to have to put it more on the corner. I think towards where survivors will loop there. Uh, we kind of put it in the middle. The old Haddonfield had a much more narrow stairway, and you could kind of block it off with a trap. You couldn't there. But man, the trap placement, well, we had a nice trap placement that we got. I believe it was Claudette around the loop. We, uh, we pushed her that way past the pallet. She ran right into it, and that was her first hook. Uh, that was a good trap placement, but man, the trap placement on that small house on the stairs going downstairs we were able to put that trap part way down the stairs that just seems like an incredible and there's no way to get around it uh and we had we definitely had somebody step i don't know if that maybe i was the meg who stepped in it the the second time on her second hook but man that trap is a dirty trap that is just that is just an unbelievable trap location so boy we got we got great value with that trap uh, the main thing we did, we pushed survivors away from where they were going to finish gens, and we fought the last part of that match. Even though the Zarina finished that gen right in our face, we had a nice little three gen, and we would have had a nice one even even if things wouldn't have snowballed there at the end. But man, alive, uh, we uh, we got we got just good value i think out of game sense we we pushed the meg away from the area we didn't have traps just to get her in our area to begin with we kept breaking pallets we turned the middle of the map into a dead zone essentially and yeah that's i think what won it for us was game sense to push people into our area a couple really nice traps just one or two mistakes by the survivors and that's a 4k for us as the trapper